Hey guys, I'm Alec Vorkov from BeTheClaw.com, and in this gettable or forgettable video, we are doing uh, some gamer green goodies. Um, I I'm going to be giving away two of the uh, two of the fidget spinners, uh, one from me and one from a person who, from a generous person who did not want to be named. And um, so at the end of this week, uh, May 11th, 2017, uh, we'll draw two names from the comments on this video. So make sure to leave a comment and. Um, you'll be automatically entered for a chance to win one of these two fidget spinners. Um, so the rest of the stuff is f um, things that I received from Gamer Green as part of the uh, Gamer Green Ambassador program. So some of them are going to be pretty forgettable, I'm pretty sure, like the pen, for example, <laughs> uh, and probably the pins as well. Um, but uh, the coaster and maybe uh, the ball, we'll see. Uh, I did have to crank up the, the strength a little bit since the um, fidget spinners do need a little bit of a stronger claw compared to the previous videos that I did with the battle claw boxes and the price pagoda stuff. So uh, let's um, let's try with the start with the fidget spinners and see if we can um, what we can get. I'm gonna do 50 plays as usual. So we'll start with the white one back there. It might be slightly harder to get just because the, the box is a little flat, but uh, as long as I aim it well and uh, don't stab it, I should be able to get a decent grab around it. And let's do that did not work out, but we'll see. Yeah, there should definitely be gettable. It's just a matter of positioning the claw properly. This should be good. Ooh, man. Uh, now this is a, a bit of a, a dead zone position, so I'm not sure. Mm -mm. I'm going to try to do a swing technique. Ooh, well, that just completely backfired, and there's absolutely no way I'm going to be able to get that. Uh, so that one's forgettable, but uh, I think we should be able to get this one. So, in general, fidget spinners are... I can't imagine that they are forgettable just because they are pretty pretty uh, well shaped. And that's forgettable. All right, we're going to forget about this one and move on to... Let's see. We want to do the ball first. Because uh, it's... I don't know... Uh, yeah, <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to get it because I have a I've, I've tried for slightly larger ones, uh, little rubber balls, and they usually are gettable. But this is pretty small, so I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get this guy. Unless I pinch it somehow, I don't really see that being gettable. It's just gonna be bouncing up and down all over the place. I think the coaster is gonna be well, probably the only thing that I might be able to. Ooh, look at this. Look at this. Game of green pen, and I am surprised I was not aiming for that, but, you know, honestly, I'm not sure if I would have been able to get this had I actually tried to get it. There's one more, so we'll we'll see if, uh, if it is gettable, but the pen is gettable. So, well, impressive. Got a nice little overbite there on the claw, so that helps. Uh, let's see... Ooh, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, I don't really, I don't really see that, I don't really see that uh, ball being gettable. Might just have to stay there. I might just have to let it go, but, oh, I keep trying. Sometimes, sometimes it surprises me. The claw has a bit of a mind of its own, which is why I suggest that uh, you be the claw when you play these things. But sometimes it's just easier said than done. Being the claw takes a good bit of uh, skill, determination, patience, and uh, money, unfortunately. So, it's one of those things. It's just one of those things. So I'm going to do a few more plays for this ball. I don't think it's gettable, and I might just have to... Mm. Let's 
Let's do a couple more just in interesting case. Because depending on how the claw grabs it, I might be able to just pinch it with two of the prongs, two of the claw fingers. Uh, if I can move it out of the way now. Alright, well, again, if we have any uh, plays at, at the end, we can return to it. I think I'm going to go for the coaster. That should be gettable pretty easily. Yeah, that's that's about as gettable as it can get <laughs> for the first try. Uh, this thing, I think it should be gettable as well, as long as I can get the... Um, and the claw inside the loop, which I just failed to do. Um, but that just means I need to not drop the claw directly over it, but slightly offset. And insert the claw in there just like that. Perfection. One second try. Gettable. Uh, let's try for this one. Uh, <laughs> Not not holding my breath because aiming for something that small is really tough. But ooh, it also requires the claw to close pretty quickly as it you know as it starts going up, and which it kind of does. Uh, this you know the strength that I have is not um, does close it pretty pretty well. But uh, well, um, I have to keep trying here. I think it's I think it's gettable just like the other thing. It's just a matter of luck, I guess. Ooh, I can guarantee that the pen is going to be impossible. <laughs> I'm not even sure why I put it in there, but it's one of the goodies that I received from Game of Green, so I felt ooh that was close. That was close, delicious. Come on, 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 come on. Come on, come on. You can do it. You can do it. Mm. Yeah, this is this is tough. And it's definitely should be gettable, but it's just mm. come on. Oh, that was so close. All right, now it's sitting a little bit higher now, so I don't know if uh, if we can pinch it somehow. Now the pen's going to be in the way, which I do not appreciate the pen doing so and now it's pretty much hmm, dead zone so I don't think the pen I'm not even going to be trying for it but the pen or whatever that thing is a little um, like keychain type thing I think I'm not sure uh, that that might still be gettable yeah, move the pen out of the way. All right, we flipped it back over. So at least it will be looking at the pretty, pretty Game of Green logo there. Okay, come on, come on. Let's go. Can we get it? Can we get it? Can we get it? Oh, it's jumped. All right. Um, see what I mean, though, about the pens that I... The one that I won without even trying, I knew that had I was actually had I actually been trying for it, I don't know if I would, that I would have been able to get it. These small small things are pretty tough. But if I can get the claw in in that little loop in there, well, that's pretty small. Pretty small loops, almost impossible. Come on. Get it. Oh. That's not happening for me, is it? Alright, well, I think I do have 20 plays left, so I'm gonna keep trying here for a little bit. It's got you know what I mean? It's it's just it's like it is gettable, I know it is, but it's just so hard to pinch it the right way. Ooh, can this be it? No. This cannot be it. Yeah. Squeeze it a little bit closer. And let's see if we can... Yeah, that claw did not spin too well, but... Ooh, yes! Yes! Yes, perfect. Gettable! Okay, why did I...
you try for this one. This is a little tougher just because it does, doesn't have that little extra metal part to it. And aiming for it's going to be tough. Alright, let's uh, zoom in just a little bit here and try to see how that's going to work out. Oh, maybe that's, there's, there's, oh my goodness, look at this. Wow. And that is some claw mastery, my friends. All right, well, um, we got, that's gettable, by the way. We got the, um, the ball and the pen. I'm going to keep trying for the ball because that's, the pen is pretty much, I'm just going to say forgettable without even trying for it, just because it's in a dead zone. The ball, is, if it's pinched a certain way, it's... Well, I mean, I suppose the pen can also be pinched, but... Uh, maybe a swing technique there for the ball, too. Oh, if we can move it out of the way. Uh, man. All right. Offset a little bit. Oh, man. Yeah. So, 13 plays left, so we'll just keep trying until something happens or not. <laughs> mm. Tell you what, that, uh, those pins are very. <laughs> I impressed myself with how I managed to get that little pin. That's, that's a tough win, considering how small it is. Alright, we need to get that ball away from the mirror. I'm just not quite sure how I'm going to do it. Well, that might be... Yeah. i tell you what. I thought it was going to be a little bit easier than this. Come on, ball. <laughs> just keep going around. All right. Mm. Yeah, it's it's in a pretty crummy position there. Pretty crummy position. I think what I want to do is maybe just. Ooh, that was I was hoping for that. I was hoping to get it away from the from the mirror, and then I can try to pinch it somehow. Come on! And it just keeps jumping. Um, if I can get it closer to the to the price sheet, maybe I can kind of toss it into the. Yeah, it's just gonna bounce back, isn't it? Didn't go, didn't quite go far enough. I got five plays left. Maybe go a little bit further back. Come on. Oh my goodness. Oh, you stinker, you. Uh, yeah, it's kind of in a dead zone right now, too, so. Yep. Oh well. Yeah, I mean, I suppose it would have been gettable had I actually wanted to test more of your patience and make you sit through all this, but you probably, probably don't want to wait that long to, f to find out. Well, I'm going to see if I can... Uh, the pen... Nah. The pen's definitely not even close to the gettable, but I'm going to try this one technique. <laughs> Yeah, swing technique's not going to work. Fidget spinner is definitely forgettable. Do one more, one last play for the uh, for the ball, and and that's it. All right, well, that's forgettable. Once again, guys, I'm giving away these fidget spinners, so make sure to comment on this video by May 11th, 2017, 10 p.m. Eastern Time, and you'll be automatically entered. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.